Hey everybody, we're Gainham Handicapping Thoroughbred Racing from my hometown track, Penn National Racecourse, Granville, Pennsylvania. It's Friday evening, December the 9th, and this is my dayatthetrack.com race of the day. Let's take a look at race 7 this evening, folks. 8.29 p.m. Eastern Post Time, 6 furlong sprint on the dirt track, 3-year-olds and up race for a claiming prize of some $20,000. Contenders number 4, having said that, number 3, Classical Chant, number 5, I'm Not Who I Was, and number 1, Golden Stride. Number 4, having said that, takes a class drop of 9 track master units. Tonight has turned in power run performances in each of his last 4, hitting the board at 3, including a power run win in his second race back. The morning line favorites, number three, Classical Chan, who's hit the board in three of his last five races overall, gets a return ride from jockey Eric Camacho tonight. Camacho has been in his irons on one previous occasion, posting a win, guns for back-to-back -back personal circle trips this evening. Race seven summary, number four, having said that, tops the contenders list, which also includes number three, Classical Chant, number five, I am not who I was, and number one, Golden Stride, four, three. 5-1 in the 7th tonight from Penn National. Bonus long shots. Let's go to Charlestown in West Virginia first. Race number 6, number 2, Bigham. 5-1 to one in the morning line. Qualifies as a track master plus power pony. Has hit the board in 4 of his last 5, winning 3 times in his recent streak of racing consistency. Staying in West Virginia, Mountaineer Park tonight. Race 4, the 4-1 to one shot. Number 8, Silver Bow. The overall speed leader in this claiming field sprinting at or about tonight's distance of five and one half furlongs on the dirt. So from Penn National on a Friday night, Rick Needham for DayAtTheTrack.com reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it.